New day, new apology. Southwest is again saying it is sorry for its holiday travel nightmare. Winter weather and other system-wide factors led to the airline canceling two-thirds of its flights over the last few days and stranding passengers everywhere. I want to speak to every single person disrupted by our challenges, and I want to offer you three things. First, my personal apology on behalf of myself and everyone at Southwest Airlines for all of this. Southwest is pledging to work day and night to restore consumer confidence. There is a page now on its website to get new, rebooked, find your bags, or request a refund. Okay, adding insult to injury to Southwest cancellation chaos, drama on board an Oakland-bound flight. The plane actually had to turn around mid-flight, head back to Hawaii because of, ready? Passengers misbehaving. NBC Barry's Gia Vang is at Oakland International with some of the passengers who just finally got home tonight. Weary passengers from flight 8909 from Honolulu wait for their bags at Oakland International. Many who were supposed to be home yesterday, like Danny Gardner. Yeah, I, th I thought we kind of lucked out because our flight didn't get canceled. It was just delayed two hours. They were already in flight almost two hours in when Nohad Vido heard. Something about a seat being pushed back and spilling a drink or something like that. And I heard loud voices and ice cubes being thrown all over the place. The pilot said, he said, if you kids don't start fight, don't stop fighting, I'm going to turn this plane around and go back to Honolulu. And I thought he was joking. Except that's exactly what happened. One of the people involved later being escorted off in this photo. Southwest telling us in a statement it was due to the behavior of customers on board. But there was more drama midair. Shortly after the U-turn, a medical emergency occurred, though it's unclear if it was related to the earlier disruption. This all comes as Southwest is experiencing cancellations galore. They canceled my fight no, two days ago. We were fortunate to get from Hawaii to California, but now we're in California instead of Denver. More than 12,000 canceled this week and 2,400 more expected tomorrow. The Southwest Airlines Pilots Association says... We've been warning of this for over five years. The last two years, we've seen more meltdowns. They've been more severe. Airline experts say it's a trifecta of bad weather and bad systems, but at least for these passengers on board 8909 tonight, they're thankful for the crew. Because all of this is just a, a, a buildup. And to be home. I'm, I can't wait to get in my own bed and eat my own food. <laughs> Those passengers coming back from Honolulu told me they were put up in hotels, given $300, and also will be reimbursed for things like ride shares or meals. Southwest Airlines put out a website today that those passengers can ask for refunds. In Oakland, Gia Vang, NBC, Bay Area News.